and welcome back guys so the last episode I noticed post editing of all the bullshit post uploading that the aspect ratio broke the bottom of the health and or blood bar that shows my disciplines and or weapon equipped doesn't show and any form of chat or anything lower than that was cut off. Admittedly, that's my fault. I began using DX Tory instead of Fraps because Fraps just... It's a good program, but it's a little intensive. And I'm using a external hard drive too. It just, for some reason, doesn't agree with some of the games I play, such as Stalker, which is the first game I actually wanted to do. Either way, so I apologize for that. I know I listed it in the annotations of the last video and whatnot, but uh, it should be fixed now. I, instead of typing in my own aspect ratio, I just fucking scaled it down to 50%. But now that I'm aware that that happened, you shouldn't see stuff like that. Either way, enough of the boring talk. So last time I finished um, the stuff with E and Lily, I recall. Uh, uh, oh, no I didn't, so we're gonna go to that, and then I realized when we were in Kilpatrick's Bail Bonds I could have picked up a quest from him, so I'm gonna go back and grab that before I continue on, so let's get going. And this is the wrong way. Um, actually no, that wasn't the wrong way, I'm just... And it midget. Okay, that's blood heal. I don't have it on this. We'll go to E in them first. The beach. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, uh. What the? Hello, sir. I'm gonna wait till that lol officer walks away, and then I'm going to. Oh no, no. Let's just take some of that there. Yes, looking at no, really. Um this Nope, it's over here. Is a more code that lasts for a minute since it was first in a muscle in essence what kills a vampire from becoming a monoceptor animal that's not for the thirst for blood. Okay. So we'll just come down here. Well, um. I think I need to talk to this guy. Brought my lily back. She told me all about what happened. I don't know why you helped this, but your blood's worth bottling. I'll never let her go again. With bottling? Uh, yeah. Gonna be getting out of LA soon. It's too dangerous here. Rosa told us something big's about to happen, and I don't want to be here when the jack comes out of the box. Take that for what you will. Uh, here comes. I'm trying to be my fault. Uh, no. Alright, let's, uh, I believe I still have her purse and shit, so let's. Hi. Oh, well, okay. His life's been hard on him. Both of us. But he forgives me. We're leaving soon. I have some family with a place out in the middle of nowhere in Oregon. Lol. It should be okay for us to stay out there as long as we're together. Lol. Um. Here. Thank you. You're welcome. Take your things. Goodbye. Um. Oh. Let's. Go back in here and go back to kill. Ah, uh, shit, really. I'm not. If you talk to Rosa, she'll tell you some stuff, but I don't really know if it's vital to anything or if it really affects anything. So, like I said, go out by the game. It's beautiful. And there you go. Spoilers, bitches. Okay. 
So now, uh, kill Patrick, yeah? Okay. Oop, oop. Mm, okay. I should have grabbed that quest when I was in there, but I was I was busy trying to uh, beat the clock, I suppose, and I just I fuckered it. So please tell me that dude's still. Oh, lol. Good, cause he was annoying as shit, and I don't fucking like him. Here we go. Patrick's bail bombs. Welcome to Kilpatrick 24 hour bail bonds. My name's Arthur Kilpatrick. How can I help you? This guy likes his job. You can. Yep, sure see do. It. I'm a third generation bondsman. Got a few employees, but I handle most every aspect of the business. I don't see this business these days. I gotta have a few Oops. other bondsmen to oh. keep the place open 24 hours. Plus a bounty hunter. I pull the graveyard shift because that's when all the crazy shit happens in Santa Monica. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, your laugh is awful. Um... You betcha. I used to do some bounty hunting myself back in the day. Takes a solid set of brass balls to make a good bounty hunter, I'll tell you that much. Oh, the bounty hunter. Old man playing video. Is this bounty hunter you have no good? Yep, damn good. His name's Carson, and he's great at what he does when he wants to do it. I can't seem to find him now, though. He's pissing me off, to be honest. I need him to go find someone. Can you find a... Uh, maybe I could... Yeah. Well, I don't feel right cutting Carson loose just yet. We go way back. I knew his father, too. Tell you what, since I'm stuck here, why don't you go look for him? Just real quick. I'll pay you for your time. I suppose I could, but you better make it worth my while. Great, great. I suppose the first place you should look is his apartment in Santa Monica Suites. Apartment 1, I think it is. Maybe you'll find something oh. that'll let you know where he's got himself to. Here's a key card that lets you in. Um. I like this guy's shirt. I mean, it looks nasty on him because he looks nasty, but you know, I can respect the way he dresses. It. That's a nice choice of clothing. It's retro as fuck, but it's a nice choice of clothing. Some Zoolander in this bitch. Oh, not Zoolander, what the fuck? Not at the Roxbury. Zoolander, what the hell, brain? Um, alrighty, uh, yep, I'll just cut right through here. Yeah, and I'm aware there's no sprint button, but, you know, you really don't need it for the maps, because they're not too big. They're more intricate, like a lot of the buildings will go underground or above ground, you know. Above ground. But, for the most part, you don't really need to sprint. I mean, you can walk, like, the fuck you would do that, I don't know. Actually, I do know, but. I believe his apartment's in here. Cause you know I, I I have a shitty fucking bullshit crappy ass apartment. Not everybody in the world lives in here. Is this dude still out? He's out, but he's alive. I already picked that lock, I believe. No, maybe. Ooh. Oh. Difficulty of eight. I don't think I can. Even if I. What the hell? I guess I can't even blood buff to pick that. Uh. Sorry. He's been hiding and I saw some really Magazine's stuff down there. Your stance, so. there was uh, no sign of McGee. I'm gonna follow up on another lead I got too. I updated the files on the computer. Uh, this is Carson signing off. Man, that sounds stupid. Eh, sounds about as good as my last video fucking sounded. Wait, I feel like I've been in here. Deja vu? Maybe. I don't. Huh. Hey. <sighs> McGee, uh, let's just hack this because I have no fucking idea what the password is. Uh, or where to find it. Okay. McGee is hiding in the tattoo. Okay. Oh. See, a lot of these 
uh, hacking and lock picking. I mean, there's key cards for almost all the doors. There's a few things you just can't get into unless you can pick, like this, for example. I'll try again. But hacking is the one that you have to go like all over the fucking place to find. Hell, I, I don't even know where, where that, where the passwords that is. I, I really have no idea. So this is why I raise a computer skill. Um, but you only really need to raise it to three because you can buy like two computer books from the guy. Um, trip, it's pawn trump, and use them and permanently increase your your bubbles to five. So, but you you generally see my reasoning. It's uh, like I said, I like the lords and stuff, and I don't want to miss out on crap. For example, that that not being able to pick that thing open in there, that, that bothers the hell out of me. But I can always come back to it at a later date. That's weird, it wouldn't let me use blood buff. Usually you can, but whatever. So it's a tattoo parlor. I believe that's right there. Oh, there's a bum. Oh, no. I feel like the bums don't give a shit if you drink some of his blood. Let's uh, go in here. But who knows, maybe they do, I mean... Oh, oh. oh. You always want to be on the lookout for the magazines, the quote-unquote skill books or tomes. Everybody calls them different things, really, but they're fucking magazines. Like, seriously. Those magazines, like, shoot them up and stuff. It's a, it's a fucking magazine, but... To he his own, I suppose. Um... And out of all of these, that one's the best, right there. That's a, that's a gorgeous looking girl. Okay, uh, them small breast sizes, oh, they beautiful. Alright, but that's not what we're here for. That's now, this is something I'll point out right now, like if I move strafe, see how you tilt? Like, as if your head's tilting? That's a little shit like that I like. I believe Dishonored. Was it Dishonored? I believe Dishonored does that. Far Cry 3 might. It's a little shit like that that I find interesting. Um, no? Nothing? Nothing? Let's answer this phone. Hello. Might I speak with Mr. Ooh. McGee? Doesn't seem to be here at the moment. Can I help well, you? I don't, actually. What sort of appointment was this? Well, Mr. McGee was going to be doing some modeling for me. Medical reference for the work that I do here in the studio. It's a shame, really. The proposition would have been quite lucrative for him. Yes, yes, I know. Obnoxiously opening a Sierra Mist Cranberry Splash on Mike. I don't care. It's delicious sustenance. Ah. Really? Maybe I could come down and model for you. Why, yes, that sounds Perhaps you could come down to my studio and we can sort out the details. Sounds good. I'm at the end of Main Street, small basement studio. The sign says Gimbal's Prosthetics. Just ring the buzzer and I'll let you in. Sounds good. I'll be there in a little while. Alright, now, if I recall, actually, there is a skill book located in my apartment place. Now that I think about it, I'm going to go take a quick gander in there and see if I can find it. Uh, some of these you want to use and some of them you don't. Uh, there's there's some min-maxing bullshit going on that you can do. I, I don't particularly give fucks. I'll, I'll use them because why the hell not? It saves me using experience on stuff that I don't have to. But like I said, it's it's really he is on. Everybody can play this game differently. There's so many chat options, there's so many ways of doing stuff, combats, and then the clans are so vastly different. Like the 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 Tremir can literally just walk through and magic everything dead. Especially especially when you get into the higher ranks of thaumaturgy. And they can dominate as well, which is all right. I think there's a book. Is it this apartment place? No. Oops. Sorry. Shut, dude. Maybe it was... Oh, 
Aha! There it is. I can barely see it in there. Okay, what is this? Peep is not just... Stats increase, thank you. Alright, that, that's... I believe I've picked up all the ones that you can pick up. Let me see something, though. Let's check my email since I'm here, see if there's any other... Any new email for me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oop. There is... What is this? Five. It has come to our attention that a sample of werewolf blood has made it into the hands of the local town. Clinic in Santa Ana for testing. There's some sort of party that's been done by the most information. Alrighty. That's... I guess we've picked up a new quest. Uh, you know how I said I did Santa Monica before? Apparently I haven't. I'm noticing things that I didn't notice before. I know a lot of people, when they do live commentary for games, they'll... They'll miss things. I'm noticing more, like the the wolf that was uh, near the building when I was going up to the pier to see the hanging dead body. Uh, you'll find out who that is in time. But I I, I hadn't noticed that before, and I for the life of me, I don't remember this quest I just picked up. So, but no, oh well, it's good stuff. You gotta see it. I gotta do it. You gotta enjoy it, and hopefully you'll enjoy it. All right, this is Gimbal's prosthetics. Let's go ahead and go. Right here, let's do this first. Yes, may I help you? Um, hello. I spoke with you on the phone a little while ago. Oh, right, right. I'll buzz you in. Thanks. Oh. Obnoxiously says, not drink. Spills a little. That's what she said. <laughs> oh, hello, oh. welcome to Gimbal's Prosthetics and Medical Supplies. You're here for the modeling job? Good, good. You seem to have rather well-developed limbs, if you don't mind me saying so. Um, who are you? Oh, yes, forgive me. My name is Gimbal. Stanley Gimbal. But, oh, dear, let us dispense with formalities. You can call me Stan. Nice to meet you, Stan. I'm ready to get started Aha, if you are. an eager participant. Very good. Just give me a few moments to get my equipment ready, my and then come on English. in and we'll get started. Okay. I realize I don't enunciate as well as I should. Blame that on the American education system. <laughs> oh, what? The, what is, oh, it's just uh, some, some magazines. Huh? All right, this dude's full of dick. So let's go in this creepy ass. Got blood packs. What is this? <laughs> oh, I couldn't do that as fast as I would like to have. Oh well. Then you've got this scary shit. Uh, well, not really scary, I guess. Just, but yeah. Why do you need all this if you're doing prosthetics? Tell ya. Shenanigans up in this. Now shit's about to go down, so. Huh? Oh, hey, help! You gotta get me out of here, man! This guy's a freaking nut job! This guy's voice acting is terrible. Who, Gimbal? Yeah, Gimbal! That guy's been taking pieces off of me and McGee over here for the last three days! He's crazy, man! Freaking crazy! Okay, now how do I open this door? Oh no! Fuck out of here. Hey, stop right there! What the hell? Seriously though, I can't. Hey, hold up! Man, fuck you, dude. Okay. Fuck it. Give me all that blood. I'm gonna walk sideways, cause 
I'm cool like that, Michael Jackson. And I'm gonna do whatever that was. Thanks, man. You're a lifesaver. I wasn't sure I was gonna make it. I'm telling you, I've been on some weird cases, but this one takes the cake. Your car's yeah. gonna take it. Yeah, that's me. How did you know? Arthur Kilpatrick sent me. What the hell was that noise? Oh, man, that's solid. I owe that guy big. I hope I can figure out a way to get him back for this. Got some work for you, so you should head back to the office. What? Oh, no, man. No, no, no. Not for me anymore. Look at my hand. Kimball took my trigger finger for a trophy. I'm all through oh. with this business. I hate to leave oh. Arthur in a lurch, but that's just the way it is. I understand. Well, I'll give him the bad news. Thanks See ya. again. Don't worry. I'll take care of old Stumpy here. Uh, yeah, better come back with the police. So, this guy in here has been... Oh. 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 That's... Uh, um... I can get in here. Yeah, so... Not sure what this is implying, if implying anything at all, but that's a lot of female clothing. Um... What the hell? Alright, well, I'll head back up here, and then... I will end it for this episode. Let's go ahead and exit this crazy ass fucking shop first. And then see if I can't sell that severed arm to the dude with guns. Well, come on, load screen. There we go. All right, then, guys. Um, thank you for watching this episode, and I'll see you next time.